you do with it okay uh, so we're looking at satellite system now in the satellite system we have uh, the global positioning okay the global position now global positioning system now under the satellite we have the global positioning one system now what happens there is this now it is used to determine the exact location okay of several modes of transport um, cars usually use GPS as satellite navigation system uh, satellites providing the air transmit signal to the surface customer install in the mode of transport receive and interpret these signals the way they are positioned at depends on very accurate timing Automat uh, automatic clocks are used in satellite is satellite transmit data indicating its position and time positions on board of transport we calculate the exact position based on that information now let's say we have maps maps.google.com hopefully it works here yes it does so now this is a good example of uh, the map of course we have different layers to it so i'll, I'll take it to the dark mode now you see that uh, we have various ways in which we can be able to locate um, the global positioning system and all these are either uh, organizations or firms that have imputed their businesses on the map that we can be able to work to locate okay we have where we can check for imagery we can switch to check for the images of each of those popular places right which is done by the map we can also check for uh, various images on that okay okay now apart from that we can also check for traffics uh, to know if now over here the, in the lucky uh, lucky koi bridge there seems to be a kind of heavy traffic going on right now and that is making the movement to be very slow. Over here, movement is very fast, showing the green, right? Here is a, is a bit slow here, and the lights that. This is just an overview showing you. Here we have transit. People are actually on transit, and if there are bikes here, if there are terrains, it shows you to like rivers are terrains. These are rivers right here. So in this bridge, there are rivers, okay? And this is also to show you where and where to navigate. To, okay just to show you where and where to navigate to. now this is what we call uh, right here toward the bridge right from here you can pass in here and here and which is the Ikoi road and you can get in toward what we call the Bainada Wat Island and there's also a school here just close toward the bridge okay okay so that's just uh, that to explain for that okay now GPS can determine a specific word location using the one satellite navigation word system cars ship planes can use the GPS when navigating to one specific word location workers to location to locate the positions on the hills or mountains used by others to calculate what distance now we have advantages the advantage could be Java to not need to Java don't need to use maps, rather they can use the GPS, right? GPS can reroute and find the quickest route of your movement and can provide useful information of petrol stations, okay? Lots of signals, there can be lots of, lots of signals, maps, if maps have been updated, there are new roads, you will not even know about that, um, so we need to check out, that could be a disadvantage, okay? Then the next one is uh, under the satellite navigation, uh, which is used to determine the exact location. We have the geographic information system. So we'll look at that. The geographic information system. Now, in the geographic information system, what we do that is that it captures, it captures, manage, and analyze what the geographic word reference word information. It can determine distance between two places, right? It can find the nearest uh, petrol station, okay, or restaurants, 
It can protect animals and plant life in certain vulnerable places. Um, it can be used in geography, science, or what? Engineer, what? Lesson. Okay. So, um, what other thing there that we need to know is um, still on the geography system, there could be, uh, for example, we have state boundaries. National Park, all these are being placed what, in the map. Example of a geographic, the use of a geographic information system is emergency services. They use it, biologists and environmentalists, they make use of it. Teachers can use it in their geography science or engineering work lessons. Okay? Now, what are the advantages? Now, for the advantages, uh, let's look at it quickly. It allows geographic and what? Thematic data of any kind to be combined in a way that shows how they are connected to each other. It allows handling and exploration of huge amount of data. It allows data to be one integrated from a wide range of very different one sources. The learning curve of GIS software can be very long. Okay, it's expensive to have that software uh, or such system. It requires enormous amount of data. It's difficult to make GIS programs, okay? Now we have the communication system. Now, for communication system, we refer to a method. Okay, we use a word to a method. Talking about using satellite signals for communication, used by media companies when sending stories, video, pictures for remote word locations. So that's what they are, right? For delivering and what for delivering and receiving data or information using telecommunications. And there are different types of medias to send and receive information. We have, for example, to send and to receive, we have the optical and fiber optics, we have the copper cables, uh Koyaza, we have the Wi-Fi. Okay. Now satellites. Uh, contains your antenna, your transponders. Your transponders uh, they allow receiving and sending of what data. Okay, solar panels for power uh, for power from the sun. Okay, and the likes of that. So the signals are converted to analog, and then they beam up to the satellite for a satellite ditch on the Earth. Okay, the signals are delivered by carrier waves, which consists of two radio waves. Each signal has its own frequent wave and bandwidth. And bandwidth. As the case we'll be talking about uh, the stream of data that flows along with it okay so what are the advantages let's just look at the advantages and advantages and we can call this a wrap okay so one is that they have good global coverage they are cheaper and faster than laying cables uh, they have a high a very high battery okay that's what the uh, they use the satellite with the mass and they're able to